So we just took the Uber from the pyramids to here. It was 65 Egyptian pounds. And we are at the National Museum of Egyptian Civilization. Yeah. And this museum was open about two months ago. They transferred 22 mummies from the pyramid area to here. And we're gonna go see them. Every single one of them. of Torres Journeys, we are visiting the National Museum of Egyptian Civilization. This is where they brought all the mummies all around Egypt to Cairo. So pretty much this is what everybody comes here for. What do you think? I think the mummies were really cool. That's really impressive. You can see all the details. You can see their teeth. You can see their hair. Everything. We highly recommend to everybody to come and visit this place. You'll really enjoy it. It's really worth it.
Well, that was a really good visit to the National Civilization of Egypt Museum, whatever it's called. Uh, seeing the mummies was magnificent. You can definitely see them up close and in detail. Uh, also, you can see a lot of the artifacts from around Egypt. They were all brought here to Cairo actually quite recently. Mm -hmm. So definitely you can give yourself some time. It is a big museum. There's a lot of artifacts, but don't think this is a huge museum where you need like two, three, four hours. Of course, give yourself enough time with the mummies yeah. and give yourself enough time seeing the other artifacts. But on all, all in all, this is definitely worth coming here. It gives you a great sense of everything that you've ever learned in a history book. Uh, early civilization so put it on your list and make sure you come uh, some notes you will not be able to take pictures where the mummies are yes. uh, you can sneak a peek if you want but they are watching otherwise you can pay an additional fee is 50 Egyptian pounds to have like a GoPro or another camera but cell phones no problem so lots of space inside so when you are here definitely come here we have come to check the train schedule tomorrow. It's quite busy. Things, people everywhere. And it's like 100 degrees. So when you arrive to the train station, you'll want to come and find the air-conditioned tickets. And you walk in this door here and to the left, and you buy, you buy your tickets. And I think then you walk over here. So we did, oh yeah. So we did look online, and they were said they were sold out. But we came here to the, to the actual train station. To actual train station, and no problem, we bought them. So we're all set for tomorrow. Traffic here is beyond maddening. I don't care what city you've ever been in. I think Cairo and even New Delhi would compete for madness. Vietnam is not even this mad. Just the amount of people and the heat. I think it's just the heat that really gets to you and makes people go crazy. But it is something else to witness in person. I'll only do it once. On the next Torres Journeys, we get on our first train in Egypt and we head off to Alexandria. Once we are in Alexandria, we walk the streets and we see what's going on at local markets. And we also try making our first street crossing in Alexandria. And we didn't have such good luck all on the next Torres Journeys.